Hello Almighty, today I am going to recap the ninth episode of the series. The Sandman. If you like this video please do subscribe and give me a like. After catching up with the latest episode, Corinthian has taken Jed and is on his way to find Rose. This episode starts with Rose and Lita both realizing that their dreams are becoming real. Rose is weakening the walls between the realms, causing dreams to come true. Lita admits that she wants to go live in her dreams with Hector and their unborn baby, saying she has a better life in her dreams rather than in the waking world. Although their dream world slowly begins to shatter as earthquakes are happening in the dreaming world. We see Lita's dream world slowly cracking and breaking from the earthquakes. Back in the dreaming, there isn't a lot of trust in Morpheus to help save and run the dreaming, as Lucian has been helping so much in his absences. This angers Morpheus but he is realizing that Lucian is more than just a librarian and might be able to help him with answers as to what is happening. Lucian of course has answers and states that it is Rose causing this, the walls are weaker and with dreams becoming true, especially for Lita, the dreaming is disturbed and Morpheus has to act. Corinthian drives Jed to the Royal Empire Hotel in Georgia, for his, work thing, that being the serial convention, asking Rose to meet him there. Rose heads straight there, Accompanied by her savior in the previous episode, Gilbert, who tags along for the journey. Falling asleep in the car on the journey, Rose visits Lita who is heavily pregnant and believes that months have passed when really it's been two hours. Morpheus finds them, and states that a ghost cannot escape his fate by hiding in the dreaming, and that they must leave as they're causing damage to the dreaming. Their child was conceived in the dreaming, and one day Morpheus will come to claim the baby. Rose gets incredibly angry, and she threatens Morpheus with her powers. Rose and Gilbert arrive at the hotel where all the serial killers are entertaining one another and mingling. Gilbert and Rose steal name tags for the serial convention, and mosey around looking for Jed. Gilbert discovers that they're all in fact serial killers and whilst he's trying to find Rose to warn her, he sees Corinthian and acts as if he recognizes him. Worried and stressed, he rushes away from the hotel, leaving a message for Rose saying that he's sorry and has had to go home. Towards the end of the episode, Morpheus is back in the realm, and Fiddles Green has come back, who turns out to be the friendly giant Gilbert, who's letting them know that the Corinthian has gathered worshippers and found Rose Walker. The Corinthian lures an imposter at the convention to his death, and whilst killing him, Jed walks in on them, and now the Corinthian and other serial killers are after him. Jed is in serious danger, and so is his sister Rose, as they find one another in the hotel, and one serial killer is chasing them. Guess who saves them? The wonderful Corinthian. Hello, Rose. You're safe with me.